why is Angelina Jolie still held accountable for the actions of Brad Pitt? When Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston split up in 2005, you had these options for Jolie. It was a given that you were on Team Brad. The official story said that he wasn't at fault. It was Jolie's tendency to ruin houses or Aniston's lack of excitement for a movie star like Brad Pitt. Pitt and Jolie tied the knot, starting the ideal family of eight that we could all adore virtually. But after that, they parted ways, and chaos ensued. In a lawsuit pertaining to a disagreement over a winery that the couple jointly owned, Jolie claimed Pitt of assaulting her and her kids while intoxicated on a private jet flight. According to the paperwork, Pitt threw wine on the family, verbally attacked the kids, and grabbed her by the head. Pitt refuted the claims, and despite FBI and child welfare investigations, no charges were brought. Even while the claims attracted attention from all over the world, the general consensus was that Angelina gives as good as she gets. Please give me a moment. Brad is doing the best he can. Have to be the Angelina role model they are emulating. Pour out your souls. Perhaps he should have stayed with Jen. Pitt's reputation grew much more. He talked candidly about his troubles and redemption. His self-deprecating statements, which earned wild acclaim from an audience of Hollywood colleagues helped him cement the deal when he won an Oscar and a Screen Actors Guild Award. He kept on directing motion pictures, excellent ones, he still got it on, too. The world wouldn't feel bad about carrying on their decades-long romance with a star they had idolized. Whatever the case, he regrets it and Jolie becomes his resentful and vengeful ex right away.